What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Tay. This is, like, my fourth recap of the night, but, you know, we knocking it out. Took a little day off, but it's cool, because YouTube took a day off, so I took a day off, too. Now I'm playing, but, um, basically, Queen and Claire dropped a video, The Misconceptions of Social Media Relationships, and I feel like let's talk about it. Like, let's really get into it. I'm gonna cover some of their points, and, yeah. Now, them and these, <laughs> like, okay, uh, not name, Lord help me, wrong couple, Queen glasses was cute. It's Clarence sitting here with these sunglasses on. Um, and then <laughs> and then he's talking about because he don't got like his line up, his edge up. And I'm like, y'all guys would do anything when that hair ain't done. <laughs> but I guess that's the same with us. Like we go throw a hat on, we go, you know, make sure y'all don't see our hair messed up. But let's get into the video. You know, I love that they're trying to be consistent this year. I love the consistency. Let's real life get into the video, what it was um um one of the misconceptions and one of the points they talked about is the fact that like just because you know they don't argue i think that's a big thing that it's like just because we don't see it or nothing like nobody's a perfect couple even their mind and they i'm gonna take them because you know i watch them the most you know just because we don't see every day with them that don't mean they don't have their bad days not even like arguments it don't even gotta be an argument just where they disagree and might not agree on everything that's natural and you know i think just because we don't see it it's sometimes like perfect couple right here and it's like it ain't like that you know what i'm saying um but why do they have to show that too i feel like a couple don't have to show them arguing you know they can be real they can still be a real life couple without us seeing all the down thoughts i understand talking about it but seeing here posting a video of y'all arguing like pointless to us another one a big one was people love to say and i've seen this so many times doing it for the money doing it for the clout um like Queen said, when they first got together, they pushed that agenda on Clarence so bad. He's just doing it for the bag. He's just doing it for the fame. He's just doing it for the clout. And never did they, well, I think people now understand, like, oh, this man was really in love with this girl. Like, they still going strong. They pushed that same agenda on Armand and Nay. Like, oh, they, Armand's just doing it for clout. Nay's just doing it for clout. They're just doing it for the money. And I'm like, bro shut up like how y'all gonna tell these people what they doing it for and then like a year later when they still together they're still just doing it for a bag or they're still just doing it for clout so okay good for you like cool great like <laughs> why does that matter to you what they're doing it for like i don't think nobody asked you why they was together like baby get out of here that's just my honest opinion but it was another thing like pictures and talking to fans in public let's really get into it I feel like some, like, I've seen um, Armand and they, like, have pictures, but I don't see them on social media, but I've seen fans, like, oh, my God, can I get a picture with you? Can I get a picture? And they don't say no. I do think sometimes maybe they're, like, do you mind posting, like, not necessarily after we leave, but can you wait a few hours before we post so not everybody know where he is? Like, I could understand them saying that. Um, but at the same time, like Queen said, it would just be some days where we went out. And, you know, like, they're famous. They're celebrities. You can't sit here and just be like, I don't want nobody to talk to me. But uh, us as people, us as regular people, could understand them just wanting to go out and chill and have that moment to just be as, no as close to normal as possible and go to a restaurant and chill and relax. Like, I say, like, if I saw a celebrity, right, you know, I feel like, oh, my God, like, I saw the celebrity. But it depends, you know. I, I don't, hey, I, honestly, I don't follow a lot of celebrities. Honestly, I don't. Um... <laughs> But it's not really one that I would, like, walk up to, like, oh, my God, can I get your picture? Like, nah, like, if I saw a celebrity, like, I saw them, y'all. Now, I feel like if they was on a game show or something, like, if I saw y'all on a reality show, I might be like, let me get y'all picture. Like, <laughs> let me go ahead. Y'all went on reality TV. Y'all wanted a little bit of fame, so let me go ahead and get that picture. <laughs> but, yeah, I feel like I understand them just wanting that time. And you can't be mad at it. Like, Queen said somebody had followed her in the bathroom once. And I was like, wait, where are we doing that? No, baby, no. Like, to me, that would be weird and creepy. Like, hold on, really? Even if it was just for a picture, wait till I get out the bathroom. Still then, don't be waiting at that door for me. Like, <laughs> following you in the bathroom is crazy. Clarence saying they would know him by his shoe game. <laughs> his, his, yeah, his shoes, he do got a nice little shoe closet. So, yeah. But y'all know me personally. I don't use public bathrooms. That's a no-go. Take me home before y'all take me to a public bathroom. I can't. Like, if I really have to go, fine. But, like, outside of that, I, I can't do public bathrooms, y'all. They just, uh, just ew, for real. 
Okay, I can't remember this point, but I do feel like, um, oh, like posting pictures, because y'all know like Parent Queen, they don't post each other as much. It's not a problem with that. I do, here's the thing, though, because, you know, Claire first was like, that's like some 19-year-olds do, and Queen was like, no, you know, it's, some people actually really enjoy posting their significant other, and I was like, yeah, you can't say it's like a young thing. I don't even think it's a new relationship thing. I think if you're in a happy relationship, right, and... You know, like, you're doing something, you know, you post it up on vacation. It might not be a vlog. You just want to post you in your bay. Like, you know, we good. Like, we live in our life. This is a part of your life, right? Like, you post your child. You know, go ahead and post. Especially, like, I'm going to say Nay, for example. She posts her mom a lot, right? At the same time, she posts herself a lot. Like, it's rarely a time where she goes a whole week without, post, like, posting something, um, Armand, he's different. He's definitely more quieter. Um, even before bro deleted his post. I know he does it often too, y'all, but like he had maybe like what 30, 40, like Nay has I think it's either four hundred or four thousand. Like she has Instagram posts, she posts it, so it's natural for her to post her man. Like I ain't even mad at it. Like I know some people take that to heart, but getting to the point, they go post what they want to post. Y'all can't sit here and expect them to post everything, even when Quinn was like, you know, sometimes you just don't want to vlog. I was like, I understand that, too. It's been times where her mom was like, you know, I won't buy to bring the camera or we're not going to bring the camera, you know, like, because they deserve that time. Like, every date does not need to be documented. Y'all decide to pick up the camera and vlog for us. We enjoy it. Um, I don't mind the sit down. I honestly love them. I feel like that's just y'all being open and vulnerable to us. And we get to hear y'all thoughts on situations. So I don't mind them doing sit down videos. I actually love the videos um and then i think sometimes it just be like i don't know what it is i feel like we the people like the public you know social media just makes it harder on couples and relationships like when people decide to do a actual truthful like we broke up video i feel we cause more drama than it should be because we want to sit here and like oh well this person was supposed to do it you know like we quit to post everybody else's business like <laughs> you know what I'm saying like sometimes I do feel social media creates a drama in a relationship or I thought breakup they could be good they do a video they're good social media creates bigger issues if y'all know what I mean y'all know what I mean but like I said the video was good it was one that I feel definitely needed to be had um they did say they just put in an offer for a house because Queen's like, y'all, we've always rented. This will be our first buy. I'm like, oh, my God, I'm so excited for them. Like, any big news like that, that's wonderful. So buy a house, yes. And, you know, fix it up your way. You know what I'm saying? Paint, do, like, renovations. Make it your expect Like, I mean, it's probably a nice house. Probably new. You know, nice house. But definitely add your own touch to it. Clarence, still with these sunglasses. I know it was a dog. I wanted to see it. Because bro's talking about the dog should be running, not walking. That's when I... I've seen some fat dogs, though. Like, I've seen fat dogs. I ain't about to judge nobody and they dogs, but my dog probably are doing... <laughs> my dog is underweight, but it's not, like, bad. Like, I feel like he's a naturally, like, bony dog. But my people say, do you feed him? I'm like, I do feed my dog. Thank you very much. But yeah, y'all, that was just lit. It was, it was a good video. I enjoyed it. Um, Claire tried to make a uh, queen get out of character at the end with the I told her she was just waiting for y'all to respond type I was like boy bye like chill not you trying to get a response out of queen but I enjoyed the video it was good vibes I hope y'all enjoyed it love y'all and do it